So today, the title says it all. It gets better. I have been delaying making this, um, but recently I've been talking to a couple of different people that are going through some troubling times. They're having issues trying to uh, get through what they consider to be uh, the worst part of their life. And I have also experienced um, through a couple of other YouTubers, I've been following a couple of other people. So, even though this, there is so many of these videos out there, I figure it can't hurt for just one more person to make a statement. And today is me. Um, a lot of you is me. A lot of the people that are uh, struggling with everything right now, that don't think it can get better. They, they're gay, they're lesbian, they're uh, transgender, they're bisexual, and they haven't come out to their family or their friends, or they have, and they're getting bad responses. It gets better. That's the, I, I have been there. I have been in your shoes to one extent or another. And a lot of people may it, say, well, you don't know what I'm going through. Well, no, I'm not, I don't know what exactly you're going through. I went through it myself. I tried, uh, I, yeah, I basically tried to commit suicide two times when I was younger. Um, thank, thank God or whoever that I did not choose to, that I did not succeed. Um, because it did get better for me. You, if you're a teen and you, you're gay or lesbian or whatever, don't feel you have to come out. You do not have to come out immediately when you feel that you have finally realized this is who you are. It may hurt not to, but it may be better for you because we, you want to have a place to live. You want to have a place to stay and there are parents out there that will throw you out. They are assholes. That's the only way I can put it. They are assholes that they would throw their child out. Um, but you want to make sure you have another place to go. You need to make sure that you are secure. I did not come out till I was 24. And even then, I struggled with it. I was still... I was still there saying, I needed, I just needed to kill myself because there was no way my family was going to accept it. My family did accept it. They accepted it well. Um, a brother that I really didn't think he would ever talk to me again, he took me in, he helped me. The, I, I did not live the life I wanted to live until I was 24. And even then, a couple years later, it was still... It was going, but it wasn't the greatest. I still was questioning questioning everything. But as time went on, I found that I was getting happier. I found people more accepting. I found that the friends that I had, some could accept me, some couldn't. Well, were they really my friend if they couldn't accept who I was? They liked me before, now they couldn't. It... It put a reality in my, in, into my thoughts to say, wait a second, am I wrong or are they wrong? Well, they were wrong. You gotta live, you gotta experience life. You cannot just throw life away. It will get better for you in the end. It may not happen tomorrow, it may not happen next year, but it will happen. You will find that love. That one person that loves you dearly, and that person will give you every reason of why you lived and why you did not decide to do something stupid. There are uh, you have the Trevor Project out there for the teens. You have it gets better a project out there. You have a Freedom Requires Wings project. There is a list of projects out there. There is a list of people to communicate with. YouTube alone has such a large gay community that you can talk to. I can talk to you. I can help you through it. You need somebody to talk to. The best way to get through it is talk about it. 
Maybe not to your family, maybe not to your friends, but talk about it with somebody. That's how you get through it. That's how you find, survive until that moment that you can come out to everybody as you feel fit. But don't do it when you're requiring to stay at their house. Don't do it to, a, to tell your roommate if you know that your roommate is a homophobic asshole. Because that ain't going to work unless you have another spot to go to. Either way, there is so many places. You go to Google and you Google and you will find so many places that of support. Like I said before, YouTube has such a large gay community and so many of them are out there posting videos for one reason. To help you. They're there to help you. They're there to talk to you. You email any of them. I guarantee if they have, if they're there, they are there to help you. There are just too many people out there not to give you, that are out there to support you for you not to think that life can get better. We all, have, we all have gone through our trying times and we've all went forward and we all found that our lives did get better. It may not be the greatest always. I have my bad days. Everybody has their bad days. But I'm not blaming it on being gay. It's not gay that's my bad days. It's just the fact I had a bad day. And I'm not going to let some asshole sit there and say, the reason you're like you are is because you're gay. The reason you're going through troubles is because you're gay. No, that is not why you're going through those troubles. It's just life. That's life. And if you you will get out of life what you exert for, uh, not maybe the word, but you got you have to go for it, and you got to live life. That's all all I can say. So once again, it does get better, and talk about it. Talk to somebody. Reach out to anybody, even if it's a stranger. I guarantee you there's somebody out there that will be your friend and they'll be glad to talk to you about what's going on in your life and help you get through it. That's all I have. Um, I hope I help somebody. Bye.